moving into the United States Women's National Team versus Australia match preview. This game is going to be on Tuesday, July 27th. It's going to be an early one. It's going to be at 4 a.m. Eastern time for those of you who are interested in watching it live. What's at stake in this game? Well, I'll just start off by saying this game is going to be monumental. The reason being is whoever gets to the second seed ends up qualifying for the quarterfinals automatically. However, if you make the third seed, there's a chance that you might not qualify. It'll really depend on what the other groups do. So from the perspective of the U.S., they can draw and finish second or if they lose it becomes a bit more of a question of how the other groups do and looking into this game from both rosters perspective i think this is going to be another really exciting match sam kerr has absolutely lit up the field she has scored three goals and assisted one in the first two matches of this competition and i think she's going to be licking her chops at the prospect of a struggling united states back line especially the way the last two games have gone so i actually fully expect her to score at least one goal in this match it's sam kerr she's absolutely lethal and overall i gotta say i think australia has a pretty solid team from the back line all the way up to the forward line i anticipate that they'll give the u.s a lot more problems than new zealand did not as many as sweden did but a little bit more than new zealand did so somewhere in the middle having said that i think the u.s is gonna have enough fire in them to go ahead and win this game and progress strongly to the quarterfinals i'm gonna predict that the u.s is gonna win this one by a score line of two to australia's one who do i think is gonna play in this lineup with the olympics going on this gets a lot more tricky but if i had to predict i think rapino Morgan and Press are going to start up in the forward line. In the midfield, I've got Juliet, Samuels, and Roosevelt starting. Then in defense, I've got Kelly O'Hara, Becky Sauerbrunn, Tierna Davidson, and Crystal Dunn playing. And then I've got a listener starting in goal. In terms of subs, Tobin Heath, Carly Lloyd, Lindsey Horan, and Emily Sonic coming in. With that in mind, and trying to make sure players don't get too, too many minutes and they get tired off for the quarterfinals or beyond, I wouldn't be surprised if Macario made another appearance. It's really all going to be contingent on how the U.S. is doing because the fact of the matter is if they lose this game it really brings into uncertainty their state for the quarterfinals so your guess really in that regard is, is as good as mine in fact i'll go as far as to say that we might even see lynn williams make an appearance so my friends do you have any bold predictions for the u.s versus australia game coming up on tuesday whatever you think comment below let me know